Hello, my name is um, Jesus Sierra. Um, I was born in Havana, immigrated to the Mission District um, when I was 12. I lived uh, half a block from a Michelin-rated restaurant, Paco's Tacos. Um, it was, <laughs> I was, that was, that was the bomb back then. Um, anyway, I'm going to read from my essay, Soul Music. Um, I want to thank Jesue for including me in this. Um, and it's about, about what's happening in the mission these days. And this is really the middle of it. I can't read the whole thing. So in the 70s, neighborhood garage parties and red, black, with red or black lights were also crowded, smoky. And yes, we all drank then too. But like the subtitle to Finding All Stars Breakthrough 1971 album, Our Latin Thing, it was indeed Nuestra Cosa, Our Thing. Couples swayed as if riding the same wave, mirroring each other's steps. The bass, the drums, the ta 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 of the clave, the, of the clave rhythms, while the horns burst out the melody and the vocals kept us in the groove. Not just with the music, but also with each other. There was ease to it all, the ease that came with the familiar. Our moves felt inevitable, like breathing. Here at the cigar bar, the music seems to be background noise to the dancers. It seems as if only alcohol, or maybe wanting to appropriate our culture as their, as their own, spurs them to the dance floor. This type of cultural appropriation is not different, is not that different from what I see these days in the mission, my old neighborhood. What used to be a predominantly Latino neighborhood is now a host, host to a proliferation of new residential condo buildings, unaffordable to the working class. The new buildings are named with words like vida, life, as if baptizing them in Spanish, word, in Spanish words will somehow preserve the heritage of the neighborhood. The past is being re rewritten by these modern day Columbuses developers and the rich settlers who inhabit, inhabit their, their new buildings. I'm reminded of this when I see a bar called Amnesia, the Alamo Draft House, which now occupies the old New Mission Theater. They kept the marquee sign from the original theater because it was deemed to be historic, since it held, the, it held some level of architectural significance. The Crown Theater across the street used to alternate Mexican movies with American films. It housed innumerable memories for many of us, but it holds no such historical significance to them. It too is now gone. The new structures replace old stores like Newberry's and 23rd and Mission. I used to buy shoes there as a kid. There were two large bins on the sidewalk in front of the store, one filled with left-footed shoes, the other with right-footed shoes. If you found the one, you liked, one, one that you liked that fit, you needed to rifle through the other bin to find a match. It was always fun to barter with, uh, if you happen to find someone, someone else holding the matching shoe. <laughs> Although those memories remain, the landscape and the people who evoke, evoke them are largely gone. Thank you.